Hello everyone, today I'm going to be going over every island in the second C in Blocks Fruits and showing you guys some secrets on them. So first of all, we have the biggest island in the second C, where you start the Kingdom of Rose. And there's a lot of cool secrets here. The first is just a fighting style, which is on the other side of the factory, over in this four, or the fifth little hole right here. And if you just go right up here, you can buy the fighting style. I don't know why, my double jumps don't seem to be working today, I must be laggy. Then, if you go over to the actual factory, so if you just go over here, up, yo, what, why is my Roblox freezing, that's kind of weird. Right over to here, you're going to see an NPC in here, Cyborg, which gives you a cool little boat. Also, every hour and a half or so, the factory actually opens, and you can go in there, and if you do the most damage to it, it has 200,000 health, you get a random fruit. Uh, you can spin a fruit and talk to the Blocks Fruit Dealer right here. And here's the manager, which can help you get the true triple katana sword. There's also the title specialist and color specialist, and the awakening expert right down here under the cafe, which you can get to just by coming over by the manager and going over to the left. Now we have green zone, there's two NPCs here. The first one is right at the very top of this island, so you're just going to make your way up to the very top leaf. Of course this happens. Okay, I don't know what's going on. I'm lagging really badly. Like, I can't even, like, use my moves to get up here. So if I can't actually get up here, let's just try and use this move. Is it gonna work? Alright, good, it worked. So now I can show the NPC. Nice. The Mysterious Man, which is where you buy the True Triple Katana. Using the Manager, you can buy that. If you jump down from there, go over to the back side of this leaf right over here. Why did I get stuck in there? What? Go back behind this leaf. You can see this guy, the Alchemist, where you can buy V2. And then, I forgot to show you V3, but it's in this area on the teleport. What's it called? What What is it called? Now I gotta remember this. Doghouse. This is where you buy V3, but it's right under the uh, Diamond Boss right here on this Sunflower area in Kingdom of Rose. Next island, we might as well do the Graveyard and the Haunted Ship. Alright, so first of all, over at this big area, you're going to see the Rip Indra NPC down here, which you can uh, change the color of your Dark Blade if you have Dark Blade V3, I don't. Down here, there's the Crew Captain, where you can increase the amount of players you have in your crew. Then we'll go over to the Cursed Ship. When you go over there, you have to be level 1000 to get in there. And when you're in here, there's three, actually there's four NPCs. The first one right here, you can get an accessory. The second one is if you go down and over to the middle, you can get, I think it's a sword. And the third one, you come back up, you go into here, and I'm pretty sure it's another accessory, right here, L Admin. And now the fourth NPC, you go to the center, and then you run in here, go under here, and if you kill the raid boss that sometimes spawns up here when you see the shipper runs down your spawn, and you get that blue flame, the Hellfire Torch, and then you talk to this guy, you can get the ghoul race. Alright, the next island we're going to do is hot and cold. So if you're wondering the best teleport to that, it would be lava, raid, lab, or docks 4, I'm pretty sure. Yep, docks 4. So over here is obviously the raid area, so you can go in here. You can put in the code red, blue, green, blue by pressing those, and you can talk to the raid guy. And then there's also a second raid at the hot area. So you're going to go up here. I don't know why I lag so bad when I try and use my moves. What is up with my internet today? I don't know. So you're going to come down into here. And this is where you buy the ticket to the raid. Right here, it's a thousand fragments. Then you're going to go up to the top of this area. And you come down here, put it in there, and the raid starts. Next island we'll do is the Forgotten Island, which is back here behind Cotton Cold. On Portal Teleport, it is Skull. So there's not much at this island. If you go over here from killing the boss, which is back there, you can talk to this guy if you get the water key from killing the boss and you get a new fighting style. So there's nothing really else at this island. The next island we'll go to is this little snow island over here. And on teleport, it's literally just called snow. So we can click on that. There's just like one thing here. So there's the normal NPCs, nothing else special. But if you go over to this side where the Winter Warriors are, run over here and drop down, you can go in here, keep running further in here, 
And if you have all the other fighting styles maxed out, you can get this superhuman fighting style. Next island is this Winter Castle right here, and on the teleport, it is Winter Castle. The actual island is called Ice Castle. And so there's no NPCs down there, but if you go in here, if I can make it in here, the NPCs... So there's this boss right here and the NPCs back there. If you kill them, you have a chance to get two different keys. One of the keys gives you, lets you go in here and open this chest, which gives you the Rengoku sword. And the other one lets you in here, where you can get a new fighting style as well. Which is the like the third new fighting style in the second C. Now the next island we're going to go to is over there. It's called the Dark Arena. So if we go onto the teleport, it's literally just Dark Arena. And if you come over to the middle, you're going to need a Fist of Darkness, which you can get from randomly opening chests. And if you put it in there, the Dark Beard boss spawns in, and he's pretty hard to defeat. Alright, now there is a couple more things that we can cover in the second C. Like, first of all, the final boss, when you leave to go to the third C, you can find it by randomly traveling around, but it's not worth it. It is an island, which you can find. We're not really going to go over that, but it's just a little boss that you can fight. And if you can sail out to sea and find him, that's pretty cool. But there's also a couple different items. So if we teleport to, like, Docks 2, which is uh, this area right here, you're going to see that's just the haunted ship. No point to go over there. You can't get in if you're not level 1,000. This island's down here. Pretty sure you guys can see that in the distance. If you go on the teleport, it is the remote island. The island I'll show you guys after this one is a secret island that doesn't have a teleport to it. Blue flowers can spawn here. You can also talk to Usopp right here. and You can get the Kabucha gun or the strongest god, I guess. The next one, you're going to want to be over by the graveyard. Oh, who is this? What a coincidence that somebody happened to be going right over to me. Alright, so where you're going to go is you're going to go over to the graveyard. Or I guess you could go to the haunted ship and then go out if you have portal. But in this kind of area... And then you're going to go over to the back, and you're just going to run towards this island right here. You'll see this little stone thing. So I'm just going to run all the way down here. And in there, there's no NPCs, but you can find some hidden flowers and stuff. It's pretty cool. There's not even really a point of me going in there to show you, but I might as well. we have got to make sure to get this video to 8 minutes long. There's quite a lot of stuff in the second C, but I think I've covered almost all of it. I can show one more little thing after this. So you can just go up through here. If I can figure out how to do that, boom. Yeah, we're in here. If you go back over to Hot and Cold, Docks 4, you're going to see over on the hot side, back by the front, all the fighting styles, which you can equip. And I'm pretty sure if you haven't seen them yet, you can actually buy them here. But I'm not 100% sure. And we can go claim some free bounty. Ha 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 ha. I'm lagging so badly. This is, like, impossible to do. This is, like, actually impossible. Alright, you know what? I'm not even in combat with him. His PvP may not even be on. What is going on? Okay, no, his PvP's not on. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. I'll also do third C soon.